This video is going to take you through the various ways of saving your Scribe projects within VideoScribe. Don't confuse this with turning your project into a video, which we call publishing. This is just how to save your work so you can come back and make changes to it later. From within your projects, the Save button is located on the top menu bar to the far left. When you click this button, you have a number of save options available to you. The first thing you should do is name your project. You can then decide which folder within Videoscribe you'd like to save your project. By default, Videoscribe will save to the All Scribes folder. This means they'll be available on the first screen when you open Videoscribe. This is a local folder, so work saved here will only be accessible on the computer you've saved it on. You can create other local folders within Videoscribe by using the Create a new folder button. Now you've named your scribe and confirmed the folder you want to save it in, you just need to click the tick and Videoscribe will save that project for you. The next save option available to you is the Online Scribes folder. This saves within your personal Sparkle account and means this project will be available on any computer you log on to. Really useful if you're working on your project from multiple locations, for example work and at home. To do this, click the Save button again and this time use the globe icon to save a copy of your project online. Now we've saved the project both locally and online, let's go back to the screen that you see when you first open Videoscribe and show you how to find those saved files. Videoscribe will default to your locally saved scribes, showing the newest first, and you can sort these in different ways. Any folders you've created will be available here, as well as access to the work you've saved online within your MySparkle account. If I hover over the project we've just saved, you can see we have a few options. Delete is available and so is the Details button. From here you can export the file. Exporting is the final save option in Videoscribe and is available on the standard save screen as well. When you click the Export button you can decide exactly where on your computer you'd like this saved. Exporting your project will allow you access to the file so you can transfer it to another computer yourself and open it in Videoscribe on that machine. That covers the saving of Scribe projects in Videoscribe. We hope you found it useful.